the A Summer of Benin, an honorary Romanian consul to Edo and Delta states of Nigeria and his entourage arrived the palace of the Olu of Wari into the warm embrace of the regent of Wari Kingdom, Prince Barrister Iruru Emiku and his council of chiefs. After the formal introduction by both parties, the Esama informed the regent that he was at the palace of the Ulu of Wari to identify with the royal family and the people of Wari Kingdom at this trying moment and conveyed his condolence to the royal family on behalf of the House of Ibnadion. The Esama recalled his long-standing relationship with the royal family as well as the link between Wari Kingdom and Benin Kingdom as he prayed for peace and unity for the kingdom. I came to identify you don't mourn. Don't mourn king because he joined the ancestors. The only thing I would say to continue to identify with the people he left behind. And also to congratulate you the council, particularly, who upheld the tradition of our land. Sir, greeting you and breathing what you can do. Who do not let the facts elude them. We do not let the present earthly world to change the tradition. My prayer is that the tenor will be better than the previous one. Amen. The regent of Wari Kingdom, Prince Barrister Eruru Emiko, who used the occasion to congratulate the Esama on his recently celebrated 81st birthday, expressed gratitude for the visit and extolled the sterling qualities of the Esama, which he said stands him out among many Nigerians. Let us use this opportunity to say a belated happy birthday to you. <laughs> that at this age you are still able to move like this. It's not only a surprise, it's a blessing. It's a blessing from God. And we thank God for it. Amen. The regent also used the occasion to intimate the Esama with the funeral arrangement of the late Olu of Wari and the preparation for coronation of the new monarch. Your Excellency, Sir Dr. Chief Gabriel Osawa Rubinejo, CFR. And your entire entourage. We welcome you to this palace today. On behalf of um, the royal family of Warwick Kingdom and your entire Shekiri people and people of Warwick Kingdom. And this shows that we have this bond that we have continues to grow. My um, grandfather, Ginoa II, who came to, who was the first king after 88 years in Teredblom, lived most of his life in Benin, in Nogbese, uh, in Benin. I think your local government uh, has close to. Uh, <laughs> 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 He said, Tony Billy is here to me. Yes, yes. <laughs> so, um, our, our bond is a very strong one. We cherish it. And we believe that it will grow stronger. Amen. Amen. Yeah. In an interview, some members of the Warwick Council of Chiefs spoke glowingly about the Esama of Benin, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Osawa Ibnadion, and commended him for the show of love for the royal family and the people of Wari Kingdom. Well, we are grateful that he's here with us, our brother from Benin. The Wari Kingdom is, is, uh, is an offshoot of the Benin Kingdom. So seeing the Esama and his entourage gives us great pleasure that the bond of unity between the Shekiri and the Benin will be strengthened from now and so on. We are He's very, very wonderful. We are very grateful. He has uh, impressed us 
we've been hearing of him, how good he is. We was close to our father, the Olu, but today we have seen how wonderful he is. Our father who has passed away now, uh, took him as a friend, took the Isama as a friend. He used to call him Isama of the world. And many times together when I was with him and with the Isama, I could see the relationship, whether here or abroad. So for him to have heard that this is what has happened, and he has taken the initiative to come and identify with us. I find that to be very faithful. After the signing of the condolence register, the Esama and his entourage took a group photograph with the regent of Wari and his council of chiefs before departing for Benin. Pius Nsogo reporting.